The effects of Hurricanes Irma and Harvey sure have taken their toll at the pump. Drivers across the state are paying about 60 cents more for a gallon of gas than they were at this time a year ago. CBS North Carolina's Bo Minnick is getting answers to find out when there may be some relief. Bo. Sharon, we all know gas prices can vary. Just in the last day, the average price of a gallon of regular here in Raleigh dropped by a penny. But when you look at prices like this and prices throughout our area, they're much higher than they were this time a month ago, and it might still be a while before that changes. Anyone who drives is sure to notice the gas prices. It's really bad. Um, 40 cents is 40 cents. I think they are high. Mm -hmm. because the storm, right? The prices did jump during Hurricane Harvey when some refineries that supply gas to North Carolina went offline. But Harvey hit Texas about three weeks ago, and prices largely remain stagnant. A little surprised that it's still high. In the triangle, the average price of a gallon of regular is 261. A month ago, it was 38 cents cheaper. It takes a lot for things to get back up and running, and then the gas to get here to begin with. You just can't snap your fingers and to get here. Thank you, man. Steve Byers owns the Grocery Boy Jr. on Lake Wheeler Road in Raleigh. He tells me getting gas here remains a question of logistics. Instead of coming up the regular pipeline from Atlanta, we're having to get it go up through the Mississippi, up through the Great Lakes, and come down the coast. And, and it takes longer to get it here, and it, and it costs more to get it here. So when might we see some relief? AAA Carolinas estimates it could be at least another couple of weeks, maybe by late September or early October, before we see gas prices finally get back to normal. For some drivers, that time can't come soon enough. That money could be going towards something else, not just on gas. And crews are still trying to get some of those refineries back online. AAA Carolinas tells me that it will take some time for the market to settle. But the good news is, once the market does settle, typically prices tend to drop this time of year. Live in Raleigh, Bo Minnick, CBS, North Carolina.